Hello YouTube, welcome to the Binding of Isaac Repentance Daily, where yesterday, for the first time in a while, I actually had a win. Feels good. Playing as Eden today with... Oh my god. Hold on. Is this... Is this legal? Is this Eden with good stats all around? Good speed, good fire rate, good damage. Above average range. Oh, but, um, oh, the luck. Yeah. Damn, what a terrible start. <laughs> no, this is actually incredible, though. Wow. Shot speed, a little bit lower. Luck is a little bit lower. But those are, like, the two that no one really cares about. And we get able. Dude, holy shit, this is... This is basically a one run. What the hell? So obviously, we start with a speed upgrade, uh, in like in the form of um, what do you call it? The virus. There's a fly in my face. That's wonderful. Yeah, in the form of the virus. But even without the virus, our speed stat would be pretty incredible, honestly. One point fourteen. Yeah, yeah, it would be. Also, something that I completely fucking forgot about the virus in Afterbirth Plus is apparently it's a speed downgrade instead of a speed upgrade. Which, uh, why? First of all, I I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't. I'll never understand. I'm too dumb to understand game design but yeah uh effectively the amount of speed that you gained from it has gone up by 0.3 because it used to be a point uh one speed downgrade which is just like fucking baffling to me but you know whatever i don't make games for a living nor will i ever most likely because uh, it's not not really my passion. It used to be something that I thought I wanted to do when I was younger. Uh, because I thought, you know, games were just made from uh, magic. And I thought, oh man, as long as I just imagine the game, I can make it, right? Kids, uh, kids are dumb. Trust me, I know. I've been a kid once myself. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, it's, it's alright. At least, because, like, the way I realized... I mean, obviously, I knew it when I was playing Afterbirth Plus. But the way that I realized what it was like was when I was playing Afterbirth Plus with my friend one day. Not too long ago. And I was... Like, we killed the mini-boss. I don't remember which one gives it to you. I think it might be Lust. We killed Lust. Right? And... He just left the virus behind, and I was like, uh, shouldn't you, oh my god, <laughs> shouldn't you pick that up? And he was like, what, no, my speed is already terrible, why would I? And I was like, what do you, what do you mean, it just gives you poison, doesn't it? It does not just give you poison. He didn't take it, because he actually, like, knew what he was talking about. And, uh... You know, I had already been indoctrinated into the repentance cycle of uh, items, <laughs> so <laughs> thank God we, I thank God he didn't listen to me on that run because that run was already pretty cursed. Yeah, well done. I'm not gonna say your name because you know who you are, but and also because it's like a breach of privacy. Uh, you're not the one uploading content online, so why the fuck should you be <laughs> put out there <laughs> for everyone to know who you are? Rest be assured. Ooh, stitches. Stitches get stitches. Rest be assured, I do have friends. Okay. You don't have to believe that, but I do. Honestly, some days I don't even believe that, so, you know, I, I, told, I totally get it. Personally, I get it. So, what's the play with Pandora's box? Well, 
case you don't know, in Repentance, they added a certain trinket that would make uh, Pandora's box incredible. However, I doubt we're going to get said trinket. Um, so instead, what we're going to do is we're just going to hold on to it, actually. Either, like, it depends on how much I need the items. Right? Because if we keep it to the womb, I think? If we keep it to the womb one, we get two boss items. If I need the stat upgrades, I will take them then. If not, we're just gonna save it to the cathedral. Because then we're gonna get two angel items. And I love me some angel items. I think I love angel items more than myself, which is not like a hard thing to do. Don't get me wrong, I'm just saying. Oh, uh -huh. I know, I made a funny joke about self-hate. It's funny, but it's not a joke. It's, uh, it's very real. Um, haven't felt happiness since I was uh, five, probably. <laughs> okay, this is a joke. I, I, I don't want to scare anyone that might be concerned for me. Uh, I mean, why not take duality, right? This way, if I actually get something, I'll get an angel deal. I don't know why I love angel deals so much. I really, like... Obviously, I liked angel deals back in Repentance and Rebirth and all that shit. But, I've really, really come to love them. Now that we have more of a guaranteed chance to get it, if we just skip Devil Deals, it's it's so much more fun to actually like go for Angel stuff now. You know? The only downside, however, is that in Afterbirth Plus, we could actually like go into devil deals and see if they were worth taking or not that is no longer a thing unless you have the glowing hourglass which by the way if i find the glowing hourglass 100 percent i'm getting rid of pandora's box i adore pandora's box i liked it back in um back in afterbirth plus as well but in repentance its usefulness has skyrocketed like, oh my god. It's inc it, like, it's amazing. Because now, obviously, if you skip item rooms entirely, you get planetariums. If you skip devil deals, you get angel. Like, it's remarkable. Honestly. And while I haven't gotten to test this out, pretty sure with duality, if you go into angel or devil deal and they're not worth it, you can just teleport out and go into the other room. I'm pretty sure it works that way. If that's true, then, uh, yeah. Glowing Hourglass is just fucking goaded. Rosary? Yes. Fire Rate Up and Health? Yes. <laughs> of course. Rosary is another one of those items that I'm really, really happy got a reworking. Because before it was just like... Oh yeah, you know, it gives you health and it pretty much guarantees you that you're going to find the Bible at some point. No one really wanted to pick that up. Now it's... It, like, it didn't even really make much sense, I don't think. But Rosary is like... Red Rosaries, if I'm not wrong, have been stained with blood and that is a Red Rosary. So it makes a lot of sense that Isaac would start crying more because of it. I don't know, I just really like the change. Oh hey, there's a Bible. <laughs> Hello, I'll, I'll just pick you up, it's fine. I mean, obviously you still have a higher chance of finding the Bible, but... Like, now the Bible is actually like kind of useful again, because it's a four-room charge. And there's a fly on my face again, God damn it! I despise flies with my entire being, but that's alright. 
That's alright, you know, they're just trying to live as well. I don't know why I'm feeling so positive today. <laughs> Maybe it's because I got a win under my belt. Maybe it's because... Uh, we actually, like, got a good Eden start. And that doesn't happen very often. Yeah, I gotta say. Pretty Pog. Gonna reroll that, obviously. Not super huge. I'm a man of my word. I am a man of my word. Now, obviously, we're not gonna get one of the benefits of this item now. Uh, obviously, we're not gonna get any planetarium chance because uh, we're way past that point. After the next floor, planetariums can't even spawn anymore, so, you know. But we get to test the Devil Angel hypothesis, which is always exciting. Now, do keep in mind that if this works, holy shit, is this item absolutely goaded. Oh, but but it's like, it's a three-room charge. You can't even use it as often anymore. But it's so much more useful now, though. Trust me, I missed when it was a two-room charge as well, because, like, fuck, it's, it's incredible. But I'm not gonna fucking cry. Do I really have to fight you again? <laughs> God, God damn it. Nah, it's alright. Obviously, like... We're probably not gonna die with like ten and a half hearts left. I did get hit twice, and that is embarrassing. But it happens sometimes, you know? Four gurglings and a stupid idiot boss. Yeah. It happens. It's fine. So, I mean, obviously, item room. We're always gonna check. Uh I may as well. Like, I'm going to check the angel room, if we get it, just in case it doesn't work the way that I think it might. I don't know, that's that's a stupid, that's a stupid way to look at it, though. Because, like, at this point, I would be willing to risk trying to get brimstone. Uh, but I also don't want to risk losing out on Godhead, so... I don't know. I don't know what I'll do. That's really good. Okay, well. We wouldn't have skipped this anyway, so it doesn't matter much. But hey. It is what it is. That's the soul of Cain. Ooh. Color me interested. I mean, I can't get it now, but I would have been interested if I could get it, but <laughs> it's, you know, it's whatever. Honestly, it's whatever. I don't need the soul of Cain. Okay, I need the soul of Cain. Never mind. I am a fucking filthy liar, and uh, no one should ever listen to what I have to say. I'm gonna grab the fool card, however. And we're gonna get a free, uh, a free boss rush item. That's, that's such, like, a convenient addition. That one of the ways to, um... Because, like, I don't know if you knew this, and you probably did, but Azazel starts with a full card, so a lot of players actually just keep that full card uh, actually just like keep the fool card until they get to boss rush because like most most players that like are actually decent at the game get to boss rush as a Zazel every fucking time so yeah it's just a nice way to get so it's really weird that they would add a way for every character to do that guaranteed but hey I'm not complaining. Now I won't have to look through cards in the shop just to find it. 
Oh no, I didn't get a fool card or a teleport card of any kind. That sucks. What makes it even weirder is the fact that the fool card teleports you right in front of. Okay, you know what? I'm. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. The pact is very good. All right. Fuck Angel. Oh wait, no. <gasps> we can still get Angel. I forgot about that. Oh, that's beautiful then. Oh man. Hell yeah. <laughs> that's so exciting. I forgot how good uh, duality actually was for a second. Well then. Uh, don't listen to what I have to say. I'm a dumbass, apparently. So we're gonna go back, we're gonna grab Soul of Cain. Oh, this is Soul Lazarus, fuck. Actually, never mind. What what the fuck does Soul of Cain look like then? It's also orange, isn't it? I'm a dumbass. I didn't even see the tinted rock. Uh yeah, I don't know. I thought I thought Soul of Cain was also. Oh, whatever. Uh, looking to replace this as soon as I can, because Solo Lazarus kills you. That's the only thing I know. <laughs> From what I could tell the one time I used it, it didn't really give any benefit, so... I feel like I've seen you before. And I feel like you're not good. I don't know, uh, any card that's better than uh, killing you without any benefits would be much appreciated. Why not take a pill? Because a pill I'm just gonna pick up and then I'm just gonna take it and move on, right? And then I have no reason not to take Soul Lazarus again. I have... What trinket did I have? Oh, okay. No, that's good. I have enough self-control now, I didn't back in the day, but I have enough self-control over my, uh, my controller, I guess, <laughs> to not accidentally press the card button. I understand why a lot of people don't like carrying around, uh, items like this for no reason, but again, I have... I have accidentally killed myself due to pressing the card button so many times. I don't know what that does, and I'm not looking to find out. Because it looks like a Suicide King card. Oh, God. A Suicide King card. Jesus Christ, my voice. So yeah, I'm not, I'm not looking to learn about that one. Oh, you thought, buddy. Instead, you just wasted time on an animation that didn't even hit me. Now what? Yeah, that's right. You got nothing. This run is incredible, by the way. Like, oh my god. I, like... I would wish to get a run this good, normally. And I, I do, sometimes. You know, on occasion. Sadly, those occasions are not me playing as Lilith, but Lilith... Look, I said this yesterday, I think. Lilith is not really my favorite. She used to be pretty cool. I don't even know what trinket I had. I didn't have one. Okay, that's why. <laughs> Lilith uh, used to be pretty cool to me, and I still think she's a very cool concept for a character. But, man, I do not like having the firing box behind me at all times. I do like the fact that pretty much any and every battery item makes her incredibly powerful, but, you know. You win some, you lose some, I guess. Gonna go in here, pop, 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 pop. What you got, homie? Nothing of use? Okay, beautiful. Thank you for wasting my time. Now, I really hope, I really hope I get 
the charge back before okay thank you <laughs> thank you for listening I never know how much of a floor is left and it always worries me because like most spacebar items you kind of want to save for like the boss fights but like so some of them are also so good that you want to use them more normally but it's so hard to because you never know how big floors are gonna be that sucks yeah look I know what I said about solo Lazarus but there has to be something else to it right yeah no I, I I'm just a dumbass probably but using it does kill you that's that's just not even a falsehood yep oh my god it works oh my god this item is so goaded not that it, it there was much of a better item in here but you know that's that's uh neither here nor there i guess right <laughs> god damn it god damn it dude Sure, adrenaline? Yeah, yeah, yeah. A little bit. I'll talk about that. I'm gonna say a little bit of an extra damage boost, and then we immediately lost said damage boost. That's wonderful, thank you. Thank you, game, for giving me the honors of that, by the way. I don't I don't know. Man, I really am becoming exactly like other Isaac content creators, right? How, it doesn't matter how much good happens, you're gonna complain about the bad shit. Oh well, you know, a bad devil deal. Back in Afterbirth Plus days, probably would have surprised me. No, not worth it. Here though, eh, you know, it's kind of par for the course. If you're still a fan of Devil Deals, more so than Angel Deals, then you're kind of getting what you deserve. And I don't mean to sound like the Joker on that one, but, you know, you, you get what you fucking deserve. That's just how it is. I don't make the rules. You think, you think if I made the rules, I would let American cops shoot innocent civilians? got a little bit political there oh wait no it's not even political it's just a fucking fact that that is what they allow to happen what soul are you again a good one soul of Isaac I don't fully remember what you do but I'm gonna use you on the Isaac fight <laughs> Nah, that's dumb. Like, the text literally says, re-roll or not. So I'm guessing it's like a... Like maybe a 50% chance to re-roll an item? And maybe it's like the Eternal D6, but wouldn't that make sense? more sense for the loss? Huh. You know, what I've learned is that the soul items... tend to have a lot to do with their tainted version. Tainted Magdalene gets health from enemies when she kills them. Or, no, that's... The Solo Magdalene lets you do that as well. Uh, Solo Kane doesn't do that though, right? Yeah, no, I don't think Solo Kane does that. Solo Kane just allows you to open up all red room doors that you can in a room which is an insane item or an insane rune or whatever you want to call it solo isaac has where items shuffle between two choices right so maybe that's what it is yeah that sounds right that said solo soul of the lost just straight up turns you into the lost so it is what it is, I guess. 
108th place, not surprised, you know, I took my time. Uh, but, you know, that's alright, we got another win. Here is yesterday's leaderboards, in case you were interested. 71st. Wasn't yesterday's like a really good run? <laughs> I, I feel like it was. Ah well. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, which I really hope you did, like and subscribe as it does help me out quite a bit. Twitch, Twitter, and Discord are all in the, all in the description. I Someday I'm going to learn to say that. And I will see you tomorrow. Goodbye and have a wonderful day.